All right guys, what is up? It is Josh back with another video. In today's video, I have a bit of a different video. I have this brand new software that's a super cool tool for any editor. I'm gonna be highlighting all its cool features. It's from the creators of Filmora. If you guys don't know Filmora, I did a video on Filmora with Dignal. Uh, we tried to edit our own Fortnite montage and it didn't go so well. And uh, yeah, kind of trashing the software a bit, but this software is actually insane. I want to say shout out to people over at Filmora for reaching out for me to actually create this video. So I hope you guys do enjoy the video. Like, comment, subscribe. Make sure to check out the first link in the description to actually download this software as I go along and highlight the different features. It's 100% free. I hope you guys do enjoy and we'll see you guys on my PC. Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to get your seatbelts on because this is going to be a wild one. There's a lot of features inside of this software. I downloaded the software for 100% free off the Wondershare website. So if you want to check that out, like I said first link in the description and you can actually download it for free all we got to do from there is it has a bunch of different features we got five here right at the top we got convert download burn transfer and toolbox I doubt any of you guys will actually be using burn though because like we don't use DVDs in 2022 but it's all good it's cool that that's a feature and uh, yeah if you're 40 years old or over the age of that this software is also for you so the first thing that I'm gonna be showing is the convert feature and all we got to do is just press add what we can do from there is we can go into our hard drive or wherever we have our YouTube video saved to. And I'm just gonna find a random video. And what it will do is it'll progressively upload this to the software. So I'll give you, so we can actually see that it has been uploaded to the software. It's a source MP4, says the resolution, the time, or the duration I should say, and then the size of the file. We can go in here, we can trim it down. So if we want to, we can go in here and kind of just like adjust the time that we actually want save and press cancel. We can also crop it as well as adjust the settings. All right, and then from there, all we gotta do is just, we can go over here to the right side, we can see the target, and we can open up this exactly, and it gives us a ton of options for us to actually change it to. So we got all these MOV, MKV, AVI, all of our standard stuff right here, MP4, uh, HAVC, MP4, which is a different style of MP4. We got WMV, literally every single format. We got a DVD kind of format, all that stuff. And then there's presets for each one, like 720, uh 4k and then we can do the audio format as something different so we can make it like an mp3 or we can just make it so it uh fits like an iphone xs max in terms of resolution stuff like that and we can also do a custom one and it should bring up the menu for that but let's just say we want to do an avi so i'm just going to do avi hd 1080p and it says that our thing will be 49 seconds just like this and it will be 90.25 megabytes and just like that it is actually converting our video and we can see the progress as we actually go along right here on the left side and it says however much time is left but i'm going to cancel it i don't need to actually convert the thing and a cool thing to notice right here is this actually has the destination file of where this is actually going to save to once it's fully converted if you actually want to convert it the next feature i'm going to be showing is the download feature all we got to do from there if we want to download something specifically let's just look up a specific video so for me it's gonna be burn juice world i'm just gonna copy the link go into our filmora software paste url right here just on the left side it will actually give us a second it sees that we have this uh, video link copied already so what it will do is it'll analyze it and it says right here juice world burn official music video and we can actually select to download the video if we'd like at uh, 1440p which is really cool or we could actually download the audio at full mega or full uh, bitrate. Sorry. So for example, if I wanted to download it right here at MP4, I just click on that right there, and I'll press download. And what that'll do is it'll start the download on the video itself. It'll analyze it, and what that'll do is it will actually download it to our PC. And just like that, it's finished. I downloaded it actually at 720p. That way, it'd be faster, so I could just quickly show you guys that it has actually downloaded to our PC. So we're gonna go here. We are going to go to the Win Wondershare free video converter, go to downloaded, and then right here we can see that the video has been fully downloaded with audio. The Obviously the quality is 720, but that's all right. You can up the quality and the frame rate if you would like. Burn, like I said, is a DVD. So like if you got a DVD drive on your PC, you can just upload a file and then it will burn it to the DVD transfer you just got to plug in your phone and then you could direct directly drag and drop across i don't have a cable around me right now but trust me all you got to do is plug in your phone using a charger that you'd normally charge your phone with literally into the usb drive on your pc and you could easily drag and drop files across and the toolbox right here we got image converter 
you know, fix a media metadata thing. So it's like if it has something bugged out with the metadata, you could fix that in the software itself. You can make a GIF maker or GIF maker, whatever you guys, however you say it. I get criticized constantly on how I say it in person. So like, however you guys say it, don't come at me in the comments. Uh, you literally upload a video. So for example, we do something like this at the file. Let's say we just want to do, I don't know, something like this. It's probably too long. But then you just do create GIF, frame rate, the size, all that stuff. You could actually record your own YouTube videos with this feature. It's super, super cool. We got a way to compress our videos without quality loss. So it's almost like lossless cut within this software. And then we have two different things right here. We have a CD burner and a CD ripper. If you guys don't know CD ripper, we can actually get the audio off the CD. CD burner, we can actually put the audio onto the CD. And like I said, if you're older than the age of 40, this software is perfect for you. But I hope I recap the software enough for you guys. It is an essential tool for editors if you guys want to get used to... Uh, but like I said, guys, I hope I recap this software well. If you are an editor, it's a great tool to have in your back pocket. For example, if a client sends you a video or a clip that's in the wrong format, you can easily transfer or convert this into the right type of file that your editing software supports. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you found it useful. Like, comment, subscribe. I hope you guys enjoy. Check out the first link in the description. Like I said, shout out to Wondershare for sending me this product to show you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you guys later in a future video. Peace out.